you know, lots of people assume that a good idea is going to sell itself. A good idea, people are going to adopt it right away. People think about technical problems, right, and technical solutions. That if you have a technical solution to a problem, then it's going to be adopted as long as it's a good idea, right? And it turns out that's not necessarily the case. Organizations are complicated objects. People have different incentives in them, and so it really depends on how those incentives align, whether the organization as a whole is going to do this thing that seems like a no-brainer, is going to adopt this technical solution. We knew we wanted to study technology adoption, so I was sitting across the table at a conference in London, and a Pakistani economist there said, hey, you should look at the soccer ball sector. Soccer balls are made out of hexagons and pentagons. The hexagons, it's easy to cut them in a way that you minimize waste of the material. Pentagons are more difficult to cut. It's, it's a harder problem. It turns out that the pattern that they were using to cut pentagons wasn't the best one. They were wasting more of this material than needed to be wasted. So our new technology was, it was both a layout, like how to fit more pentagons into a rectangle, and it was a, a piece of equipment, a die, that you could then use to cut more pentagons out of the sheet. We gave it out to 35 firms. Almost a year and a half later, only six had adopted it. So that was sort of puzzling. We were wondering why that, why that was. It was a good idea. It seemed like a no-brainer technology that these firms were not taking up. And so then the project became about, like, why not? And the main thing they told us is that their workers didn't like it. You realize that what was happening is that those cutters are paid piece rate. They're just paid per ball. And our new die was slowing them down. All those gains were going to the owners, and the workers were just, their wages were going down. So we did a second experiment where we went in and we said, hey, we'll pay a month's bonus if they can demonstrate that the technology works. The workers were excited about that. They were happy to do that. They showed that the technology was working. And then a statistically significant share of the firms ended up adopting after that happened. Often technological change requires organizational change. It's not just coming up with a new idea. What are the incentives of different people at different levels of that organization? And you really need to have buy-in all the way through the organization in order for a new idea to really be adopted.